So the old mailbox is looking a little worn out, so I figured today I'd take the time. I thought it through before starting the project, and I'm just going to modify my mailbox post so it looks a little more updated and put a new mailbox on the top. You can see right here, it's not level, and it just looks kind of cruddy on an old wooden post that actually the garbage can's knocked down. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take cement block, and since this home is a mid-century modern neighborhood, I'm going to just make a little pattern, come up the post, and put a new box on the top. So what's nice about this mailbox is it came with all the screws, and it even came with the drill bit and a template for me to use to put the holes in to secure the mailbox. So the first thing I did is I took my level, I took this gravel, peeled it back, and I have this space now, a nice space right here that I can lay cement in to form a good base for my concrete and then my block will just stack right on top of it and the project should go pretty quickly. I'm just going to use a little bag of quick creed, mix it up. Again, I use my level, make sure it's all completely leveled out. Both sides. And then I'm going to pour the concrete. Now I got plenty of concrete in there down in the bottom and all the way around and I want to let that dry so that I don't start stacking the blocks until it's totally ready because I don't want to change my level at the bottom. That's my base and that's the most important thing to build off of. So once my cement's dry in the block and I used quickcrete so I'm giving it around 30 minutes before I stack any more block on there and then I'm going to use my tile trowel. This is for putting down tile and I'm going to apply some mortar on here all the way around so that I have good adhesion between each block that I put on. You could probably use construction adhesive but I want it to last longer without movement so I'm going to add cement. Now I let it dry a little and I'm going to go over it with a nice clean water and a sponge just to give it one last little cleanup, get off any extra mortar. Now we're just going to tighten these down and then we'll go around and probably caulk underneath it. So there you have it. Everything is level. Now you can paint it or do whatever you want with it. Once it dries, it'll look really nice. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.